Hi everyone, Frankie here, New West Reset. Look at that, look at that, look at this building that I found. Is this not serendipitous? Serendipit if this wasn't meant to be, then I don't know what is. New West Luxury State Homes. We have moved, oh, okay. Well, I guess I can, my name's on the place. Maybe I can just get the keys and walk in. I don't know, anyway. Uh, today I'm on the corner of 14th Street and Kensington Road in the Kensington neighborhood here in Calgary And we're gonna definitely check out this beautiful red brick Beauty here. We're on the back side of it right now, which is the north facing side And the reason for that is because of the sign Obviously that caught my eye right away, but uh, also This is something we rarely see We rarely see this around here Sometimes we'll see a shack on the back, but we rarely see this kind of thing with like an entrance to get down into the basement level of the building in one of these contraptions. I know some of you out there, if you live in the US or even over in Europe, this is something you see a lot. Even in Eastern Canada, we see that a lot, but out here in Calgary, uh, I don't recall in recent memory seeing one of these things, but anyways, really interesting. So of course you can see here the ground is not level at all and the brick goes right down into the ground and then they've just asphalt or paved right into it right up to it so it's all kind of hanky janky all along the back side of this thing put some skylights in here to get light into the basement and then you know vents to let some air circulate out of here really big windows got some sort of a, like a wide one and a narrow one and a wide one narrow one seems to be the sort of the pattern on it it's kind of neat a little bit of a difference in the brick there so I don't know if there was a repair done here or a cleaning or what the deal is but slightly different colors in the brickwork there which is kind of odd but anyway let's keep looking something up there I don't know what that is again it's kind of not really level back here still a bit of ice and snow on the ground by back here by the way even though it's a beautiful warm sunny day today Okay, so this is now the west-facing side of this beautiful old building. A really big window here, I see. But that looks like it was added in after the fact. Yeah, it was added in after the fact. You can see where they cut the brick and then they sprayed in some spray foam there along that where they cut. So, kind of the bottom of that window looks a little different too. A bunch of vents down below as well. Very suspect. Looks like they've done some repair work over here too. Let's see, that spray foam insulation all in there. I think, yeah. Probably once they put in all this electrical and to plug in your car in the winter, they've had to sort of do some repair work maybe. That, that would be my guess anyway. See anything else here? It's, I mean, it's well looked after. There's not a lot of graffiti and stuff on it, which is normally the case, especially a big red wall like that. They're just asking for some jerk to come by and deface the thing. So now we're gonna have a look at the uh, south facing side of the building. Got a little bit of a surprise here for you on this one. So this is now, uh, this part of the building is now a gym. The Kensington gym, and there's a hair salon in there apparently. So, uh, very neat looking entranceway here. Pretty good sized door with the transom window above it. They've kind of refaced all of this with, I don't know what that is. Probably just some tin or something or, I don't know. It's like wood, I think. It's hard to tell. Beautiful arched windows here with keystone above and then the little transom in there and then the big huge window and that goes all the way down. But that's beautiful and everything, but whoa. Look at this. Look at this mud flare that's all been dug out here. From the sidewalk and street level down to here is about, I don't know, three and a half, four feet maybe. And big huge windows, same size as these windows and lining up perfectly. So don't tell me that they scooped all this out after the fact and punched in some windows to allow light in here for the basement. Don't come around here with that stuff. Because I ain't buying it if you're selling it. But uh, definitely beautiful detail here. All of these windows have beautiful arch detail all along the top. And then along the bottom there, I'm not sure what that is. I'm not sure if maybe it's concrete that's been painted. It could be limestone. 
it's been painted. Either way, it's definitely been painted because they've done a lot to maintain this building. I think if this would be a high maintenance building. It's a very, very busy intersection here in Kensington. So, but yeah, you can just see how the ground just slopes right down from that door, which we know this here facade has, has been changed and added. So maybe this door originally wasn't even here and they just punched a hole in there. There's a nice noisy bus here. Hello. Anyway, that slopes right down, and you've got all these windows here. And the gym's in the basement, by the way, which is weird. And you can see how it slopes back up right there, back to sidewalk at street level again. Then the main entrance, which is here on the east side of the building, you've got to go up a big, huge set of stairs to get up inside it. It's going to get noisy. It's going to have to holler at you. Sorry. There's the, uh, well, there's the date they give us anyways, Alberta government telephone. So this was the old uh, telephone head office for Alberta. Beautiful arch door there, again with the window detail above. But you gotta go up all these steps to get in. It's crazy. Arch windows along the front here, beautiful details. But then again, down here again, you got this, there's your, Ground level, street level, sidewalk, and it shoots right down. Shooting right down in there. What is going on with that? So yeah, very, very interesting building. As you can see here where they've added like cinder block and then built the stairway up with concrete and then they've just kind of tied in some of the brickwork to it. So one wonders if perhaps there was a door that was at the same, the top of that door was at the same level as these windows right here. And then this was a window that they made into a door maybe. Because the height, the top there looks identical there and the detail there is the same. The width looks to be the same. So it's just a matter of, okay, we're just gonna swap out that window to a door because the, the original door is down there. At least that's what I'm thinking. But in either, either case, it's a really, really nice looking old building. Just quite a gorgeous old building there. And again, my apologies for the noise, but very busy street right here on uh, Kensington Road and 14th Street, northwest here in Calgary. The old AGT or Alberta Government Telephone Building. And the date on there, 1922. All right, sure, whatever you say. So that's going to seal the deal here for today. And you know what you think down below. Until the next one, take care of yourselves and have a good one.